Good morning. Join me on a Christmas trip to Germany. Today we'll be flying to Berlin, but Berlin is not our final destination because tomorrow we will be taking the train to another town and I believe this town has got the nicest or most beautiful Christmas markets in Germany and maybe within Europe. But let's see, so come and join me on my wee holiday. me just arrived in Berlin at my hotel. It's Hotel Rossi. It's pretty close to Berlin Central Station and yeah it's actually it was pretty cheap um, for the fact that the Christmas market is on and it's pretty busy in the city. Um, so yeah um, I can recommend it I guess. The only thing that I'm not really missing uh, that I am missing is like a kettle or like tea and coffee facilities but I'm only staying one night. Um, and I'll be out tomorrow morning to take the train. So yeah, I'll give you a wee uh, quick tour though. This is the bedroom, the bed, TV. Then <laughs> we've got a wee sink and then we've got a bathroom and a shower. For this room I paid about 80 euros and you might be wondering why aren't you just like going to your destination like straight away because it's only seven o'clock here right could have got a, a a train this evening that's because i made a mistake um yeah i hope i won't get slaughtered for this but i booked the wrong flight um i booked a flight for january i had to book quite a few flights because ian and his dad are coming over a few days later they're flying into berlin and i'll meet them in berlin it's all all over the place it's a whole Germany tour right so anyway I booked flight a flight for me and thinking oh you know 30 pounds that's really cheap you know flying to Germany for Christmas markets and um, on a Friday you know many people would go to Germany just for the weekend why is it so cheap didn't even question it and I think I booked it for the because the day is the 15th I must have booked it for and it was also a Friday but in January so a few weeks and that flight look cut a long story short that flight would have landed like at 11 in the evening and at that point there was definitely like no train in from Berlin Central Station and also by the time you get to the Central Station you know it would take ages so I had at that point I had booked a room here so I think it just breaks up the journey a little bit which is good I won't be doing much today. I'll be doing some editing and I got some dinner at the central station. Now, if you're thinking she must be missing like her uh, German food, well, I got uh, fried noodles. <laughs> Woohoo. And yeah, I did, I did go to a German bakery. So I'll have that and then I'll be doing some editing and then I'll see you all tomorrow. Good morning. This is the view that we weren't able to see yesterday because it was already dark. I've just had breakfast. Breakfast was actually included in the price. So I think that was really good. And I will wait until this week's video has been has gone online at nine. And then after that, I'll head off to Central Station. Good morning and welcome to Airford. We arrived yesterday, well I arrived on time, mom didn't, she arrived two hours, well three hours late. 
So it took her, was it nine hours, Mum? I think. Exactly. The 12 euros that mum paid for her train ticket, right? Um, so, I mean, honestly, can't really complain, but um, I, I thought I would just show you the flat. It's honestly, it's really beautiful. It's pretty central in Erfurt. Now, Erfurt is a small city, bigger town. And um, so everything basically is central. But yeah, this is our flat. We've got our wee kitchen. This mug here, we have to bring back to the um, Christmas market because there was a five pound deposit on it. And then this is my bedroom. Five euro. Oh, five pound, uh, yeah, five euro. Mom's correcting me, yeah, five euro. Then this is mom's room. This is the view from our flat. We're on the attic, so it can get, I think, pretty cold in winter, and then in summer it will be absolutely roasting in here. Eh? Yeah, room, yeah it, it must be like my old kids' room. But it's, I mean, they've got plenty of heating on. I mean, in the winter, it's, it's perfect. Aye, it's perfect. It, it's really well. It's really well made. Mm -hmm. The reason why we love Airfoot so much is that there's one big market in Airfoot. We didn't go there yesterday because yesterday was Saturday. Honestly, it was mobbed. I think. If I can say something about probably all Christmas markets in Germany, it will be mobbed on a Saturday, obviously. But apart from that, we went to very, they've got like small individual um, Christmas markets scattered throughout the whole town. And to get an idea how many Christmas markets there actually are, look at the list um, we were given by the um, hosts. They're, so, they're just so many with the opening uh, times, which is really handy. Not all Christmas markets will be open today because it's Sunday. Shops close in Germany on a Sunday. Um, but most of the, or some Christmas markets will be open. Eh? I think they'll all yeah. be open on a Sunday. Oh, I'll be. Yeah, Saturday, Sunday. Even the, the, small the small ones? The small ones won't be open during the week, I don't think. Because mm. they can't, you know, they won't have all the people. Mm -hmm. It won't be Saturday, Sunday, it won't be okay christmas markets though, christmas right? markets and it's the fifth most beautiful christmas market in europe did you hear that and uh, i said that at the beginning i said i think it's europe's nicest or most beautiful christmas market yes. one of them well, I see it's the fifth one, um, but, uh, well, fifth one is yeah, that's well, very say, but that's I good see, i read it somewhere yeah i want to know where the other four ones oh yeah so we that. i think it says the minister Lot nicer, lot, lot nicer. Lot nicer than Minster. Oh, exactly, yeah. We're now off to get breakfast. Mum booked a table at this lovely wee cafe, which we'll show you. And, well, I mean, to be honest, Mom, when, when I went out, I thought, oh, we have to go there, yeah. sorry. I thought, it is so quiet. I forgot how quiet it is on a Sunday in Germany. Oh, right. Of and because we don't have it here. Uh, well, in in Scotland. And you get the church bells ringing. Aye. We had a place that was really nice in Um, a, a, a accommodation of small apartment right next to a church. Oh, next oh, to a church. Oh, and the bells ringing. Oh, no. But what time was it? Six o'clock? Well, we had the first of all the clock going every, every the chiming on the hour. Oh, and God. every quarter of an hour in the night. That must have driven Papa nuts. And then, yes, and then, and then, yeah, down, 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 down on the Sunday morning. <laughs> oh, so, and it was a lovely apartment that we go back to. Mum can't wait. When does it open? I don't no. know. Uh, here, 12 o'clock. Oh, 12 o'clock. Oh, so we still have a bit of time.
got the rum top and mum has a Swedish punch. With, with Advocat white chocolate and white uh, mulled wine. Whoa. Yes. Sugar shock. Tell me if you like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's very hot. Oh. It's nice. Oh yeah. For the next few days we just explored all wee Christmas markets in Erfurt but I didn't do much filming as there were too many people and I just enjoyed having some family time. If you got this far in the video why not like and subscribe, you'd really support me and the channel plus it's free and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!